Hey there, everyone. Well, it is now official. If you caught my live, if you caught my live stream, stream reaction, then you know that you then you know the Malar that Miami Heat season is done. Malarkey Bucks move on to round two. Man, it is quite sh shameful for Miami Heat fans. Still, let's give them credit for at least trying. I mean, seriously, this is the team that made the NBA Finals last year, only to lose into the first round without a single victory. Still, still, I gotta give them tr credit. They did make made it this far. I am not going. I am not going to slaughter them. But still, Malarkey Bucks fan fans, you should be grateful that you that you're getting this early rest. You sweep Miami. Your team sweeps Miami four games to zero. Even though Giannis wasn't at his best at the time. Unbelievable. Yeah, Giannis wasn't even at his best during the during those game during during that fourth game. And also, let's not forget, this victory came with a price. Dante DiVincenzo out for the year, which means you're going to be without this guy all throughout the remainder of your playoff playoffs. Anyways, let's review them all. At first, this at first this season was going to be close when the Bucks won in overtime in Game One, 109 to 107. But then it turned into a slaughterhouse the next two games. Games. The biggest slaughterhouse was Game Two. One hundred thirty-two to ninety-eight back in Game Two. Game Three. One hundred thirteen to eighty-four, and let's not forget Game Four, which I did earlier today. One hundred twenty to one hundred and three. Of course, my of course, if you caught my live reaction video, you you know it was a tight rate. Miami Heat was in control of that game from the start, but then Bucks came back to win it. I cannot, I cannot believe this. Miami Heat fans, better luck next year. And as for the Bucks fans, get right, better watch those Brooklyn Nets and Boston Celtics games this weekend, this week, because guess what? You never know who you might face. So to all you Bucks fans, game four of the Nets and Celtics is on, is tomorrow. And then you got game five on Tuesday. And I'll see you all when I bring you even more breaking news.